the key objectives of IEC 2 certified uh, in cybersecurity domain one, which is security principle, is that you must be able to uh, master the ability to explain foundational concept of cybersecurity principle, which is basically the CIA trial that I just uh, went over. Then the ability to recognize a foundational security concept of information assurance. That is, you must be able to uh, identify when we are talking about confidentiality, integrity, uh, and availability, and also when we are talking about authentication, non-reputation, authorization, privacy. These are things you should be able to recognize. There, you must have, uh, also be able to define risk management terminology and summarize the process, you know, uh, how to prioritize risk, you know, how to define uh, situations, you know, that lead to risk. So you must be able to relate risk management also to personal and professional practices. Also, you must have the ability to classify different types of security controls. You must be able to uh, differentiate policies, procedures, standards, regulations, and laws. So where what is different between regulations and laws what's different between procedures and policies and standards. These are things you must be able to do. Then you must be able to have the ability to demonstrate the relationship among these governance elements. So how does regulations relate to standards? How does standards relate to procedures? How does procedures relate to policies? And then you have the ability to also analyze outcomes according to the canons of IEC 2 Code of Ethics. So uh, given situations that uh, happens daily, you know, things that you encounter in your daily activities or daily operations, and then they will expect you to be able to uh, give an interpretation of what does the ethics of cybersecurity say about such a situation. For instance, if you're in a place where people are trying to pirate or create a fake document, as a cybersecurity professional, what are you expected to do? What are the ethics of uh, IEC2 that you are expected to uphold? So this is basically running through uh, domain one security principles of the cyber, certified in cyber security uh, by IEC2. This is cyber culture interface. If you have gone through this video and it makes any sense or it has helped you in any way, please like the video and share with your friends. And also please subscribe so that we can grow this channel and put up more amazing content. Please watch out for review of domain two of certified in cyber security.